My name is Arvind Anantan. I'm the product marketing manager for Embedded IDE Link VS uh, from the MathWorks. So I'm here to show you a demo um, um, as to how the product connects MATLAB and Simulink in real-time workshop, uh, the products from MathWorks, with the visual DSP++ environment from analog devices. So you can essentially um, create your algorithms in MATLAB and Simulink and generate code and implement them on Blackfin, Shark, as well as Tiger Shark devices. The demo that I have today is essentially an audio parametric equalizer that was created uh, in Simulink and MATLAB. This parametric equalizer in, um, that, you sh that you see over here, we started off creating it in, in Simulink um, using blocks. And we tested out completely in floating point and fixed point design. And this model also has a GUI that was created in MATLAB. So the GUI allows you to control the three different bands of this parametric equalizer. Now through the GUI, you can change three aspects, or the three parameters of each band, which is the center frequency, the bandwidth, as well as the amplitude of the attenuation of each band. So I'm going to start moving this up and down. Um, and as I do that, you can, you can hear the change in the frequency content of the music. So right now, I'm going to move this band all the way from low bass to high bass. And what it's doing is, as soon as I make the change, it stops the processor, it uploads a new set of coefficients, and restarts the processor. Essentially, the way it's doing that is it's talking to certain uh, MATLAB commands. It's executing a certain MATLAB commands, which talks to the Visual DSP environment to essentially affect these changes. And in the background, you can see that the analog devices uh, Visual DSP++ environment is already running. You can see it's running. It's loaded up the project. And that project was actually created from the Simulink model, which implements the three bi-quad filters. Now, this is a version of a bi-quad uh, uh, filter that we have implemented. Now, there's also subsequent versions where if you want to implement a more uh, processor-specific uh, code, such as like the... Uh, the Blackfin specific bi-quad that comes with the visual audio libraries, you can certainly integrate that into Simulink as well. So there's a wide gamut of uh, applications of these tools and, and also for more optimized uh, and efficient code generation is possible.